So now it's about to be done. Uh, only needs zero point zero five percent, and there it just be done. Um, yes, here we have the server, and uh, you have the exe here. So now we are gonna enter the CSS folder and go to C strike and CFG. Take your server CFG file, cut it, and paste it into your to your CFG folder. So now you have your settings in your server. So now hit the internet button and go straight to Google, and you need to search for Steam CMD. Go to the first link and on the website there is a blue dark link like on SRCDS. Um click the Windows the zip file and you will get the Steam CMD WinRAW file. When it's done downloading, open it, minimize your internet, and drag the Steam CMD that you see out on your desktop. Close the WinRAW make a new folder because when you launch the the steam cmd it's gonna spam some files put it in the folder so you don't spam your desktop with the folders um, launch the steam cmd then the folders are about to be spammed you can see voila then now you have the Steam CMD installed um, and up to date. So you need to write login anonymous and then click enter, and then it will connect you to the Steam public anonymously. So. Um, then you need to write force underscore install underscore dear. It is saying install force the install to the directory. So we need to force the install to go to go to the local disk and into our source folder and CSS. So you'll need to write this into here. So I'm starting to write the local disk slash source one slash CSS and then click enter. So now the program here is in this folder. So now you need to write app update and then 232 330. That's the number of source dedicated server. You can scroll down here and you can find it right here. It's for the Counter Strike source dedicated server. 232 330 so write that into your CMD and click enter so now it will actually download uh, one more Counter-Strike source server um, but it is only overriding the files that are isn't up to date so you're not downloading a whole server only updating the old files you can see it was rail dating. But I'm gonna pause the video again and I will return when this is almost done. So, see ya about some minutes.